The Jammu and Kashmir Chief Minister there batting for the AFSPA, the Armed Forces Special Powers Act being revoked from parts of Jammu and Kashmir. Pradeep Dutt on the phone line with more on this. Uh, Pradeep, uh, the Jammu and Kashmir Chief Minister once again uh, holding ground. Yes, once again he has reiterated his stand that this Armed Forces Special Powers Act need to be revoked. He said that if people feel that the last of the gun is removed from the state, that will never happen. So it's the time that one needs to take some kind of a bold initiative. And he said that there are earlier also when he decided to remove bunkers from the Srinagar city, and that there were people who were objecting to it. They feel that it will give high certainty, and nothing has happened so far. He said the same thing is going to happen. What actually right now feels so uh, one finds impossible. It is really possible, and one need to take such bold initiatives of revoking Armed Force Special Power Act. He also made it clear that uh, because we have seen that during the uh, past few weeks there had been a um, uh, war of words between the Congress as well as the National Conference over the issue in which Safadin Souls had really made it clear that the, they, there was no consensus between the two coalition partners. On this also, Omar Abdullah said that they are going to take up the matter very soon in the cabinet meeting also where they are going to discuss about all these uh, things. And today at uh, 4, there is a going to be a unified command meeting which will be chaired by the chief minister. All the senior army officers as well as the paramilitary force officers will be present where they will try to assess the ground situation. He said, but uh, he seems to be quite clear that uh, the revocation of the armed force special power is really going to have a good impact on the people people of Jammu and Kashmir. That's why he insisted that need to be revoked. And so he said that this is that the time is right for the board initiatives because situation on ground is totally different because we have seen that because what the government has been right now insisting is that the ASPA should be revoked from or uh, withdrawn from the two districts. That is uh, Srinagar as well as Badgan. He said that we have right. never seen for the last few years that army had been really operating on streets in um, either in Badgam or in Srinagar. So the footprints of the army not there in this two districts. So what is the need for having this Armed Force Special Power Act? He said this is going to boost the confidence of the people because people really in Valley feel this need to be revoked. That is what actually Omar Abdullah kept on insisting once again, retreating yes, his Pradeep. stand of the joint Armed Force Special Power Act. Stay with us, Pradeep. Let's uh, once again listen in to Omar Abdullah uh, there uh, talking on AFSPA. The way forward in your, in your view. Well, obviously, uh, there will be uh, an element of consultation uh, that will continue. Uh, there is a unified uh, command headquarters meeting uh, later this afternoon at which both myself and the Honorable Deputy Chief Minister will be present. Subsequently, uh, at a future date yet to be decided, uh, but not too far away, uh, this matter will come up for discussion uh, in the cabinet as well. I had uh, a brief discussion on the telephone uh, with the Union Home Minister about this issue uh, yesterday evening as well. So as far as I'm concerned, uh, the necessary process of consultation uh, is ongoing. And uh, beyond that, I would not like to prejudge uh, what the result of that would be.